Hey guys, today I'm going to teach you how to make this adorable kitty eared hat. I wear this all the time, it's one of my favorite hats. This is a complete beginner project. Anyone can make this. Um, it's super, super, super easy. The like giant skeins of acrylic yarn at Walmart are perfect for this. Alright guys, this is seriously the easiest thing ever. You're going to start out by chaining 60 stitches. So this hat is worked in half double crochet. What you're going to do is yarn over and you're going to skip that first chain right there and then do a half double crochet into the second chain from hook. And then you're simply going to half double crochet into every chain down the row for a total of 59 half double crochets. And for a little tutorial, you half double crochet by yarning over, inserting the hook into the chain, pulling up a loop, yarning over again, and pulling through all three loops on the hook. All right, guys, so you should have 59 half double crochets. And now we're going to do row number two. So chain one and turn, and then we're going to do 59 more half double crochets all the way back down the row. And this is really all the hat is, is half double crochet, row upon row upon row. So this half double crochet is really, really stretchy. This should fit any adult size head. I know the next thing you're going to ask me is, how long do I want the hat to be? How many rows? So you're going to keep repeating this row until the hat is as tall as you want. There is not a set amount of rows. You want to repeat that one row until the work from your cast on edge measures seven and a half inches. Well, let me show you what I mean. So I'm going to keep cro crocheting all the way up until it measures seven and a half inches. And then what I'm going to do is fold it over and sew up the side and the top, which I'll show you that next, after I'm done crocheting this. So you're going to fold the hat in half and decide what end looks best as the top and the bottom. Because of this nice finished off edge right here, I'm going to make this the bottom. So you just turn it around and you're going to use this end to sew a seam like this. Enjoy your new kitty hat.